Oh, I guess I'm live. <laughs> Welcome, my lava lava crew, my lava lava who, my lava lava you, because I love a lover you. Yes, I do. Yes, I love a lover you. Yes, I do. Yes, I love a lover you. Hello, guys. Anybody, 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 anybody? I got some ranch here. Of course, it's a wing stop ranch. I feel like I need to cut this light on. Because I feel like it's dark. And then I also feel like I hear, give me two seconds, y'all. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There he is. Somebody's outside. Hey, Ramsey Play of Life. How you doing? I'm doing well. I must say, in the midst of everything. <laughs> hey, Creative Creole, how you doing today? I got me some wings. I happened to get them the other day. <laughs> I'm about to tell you how to get them. I got the Louisiana buffalo wing sauce. And when I tasted it in my finger, they was kind of spicy. So I went to go get some more wings. Our stores around here are just gone, like food gone. Uh, that's a good wing sauce. It's a little spicy, but it's good. Mm. I already make a mess. <laughs> hey, Stina Grubbs, how you doing today? I see you. I see. You. So, what y'all been up to? I got on because I said I haven't done a video and I need to do a video. Might as well make it alive to see how everybody's doing. Awesome. I'm so glad everybody's doing well. It is, it's really good. I also got me some sushi over here that I got from the store. They make it in store at our Kroger. <laughs> and what was so funny, I walked all the way around the store all the freezer section is about bare. All the meat is wiped out, just about. All the like the noodles and stuff like that's gone. I get around there to the, the sushi section, and he got a whole stock over there. I was like, really, people, really. So I got me some sushi. I happen to know the little guy. He lives here. And it used to be another one. And the other one that cooks there, I know he goes back home. So he's probably stuck at home. He goes back for the holidays and he'll take like a month vacation and you won't see him. And then he'll pop up. So he's probably stuck over there. But this, the one that cooks here, he don't ever go back home. I got my favorite drink in the house, Flathead Lake. And you haven't gone shopping yet. I'm just saying, okay, the best time to go is early, early, early in the morning, like 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, because they've been a stock what they have overnight. And then you'll get first dibs or whatever's there. I learned that one. The first day we ran out of tissue, I was like, when are y'all going to stock up again? He said, they're going to put it out on the shelves tonight, come back in the morning. I went back and got me some.
So make sure you get you some. I hate to say be like the other people, but get you enough because if these ha white houses run out, we're going to be out of luck for a minute. And then I was reading on CNN how there's talk about a nationwide shutdown. Don't want to spook nobody or nothing like that. If you spook your jitterish or nerves, anxious, any, any of them things like that. <laughs> hey, Frank GTV, how you doing? She said, I have a while back from Costco. Okay. My sister went on a cruise. And she's on her way back. And I was telling her, if you need to make groceries or something, there's not much left. All I wanted was some fries to go with my wings. That was gone. And I said, okay, where does go with wings? Pizza. <laughs> I said, so let me give me some pizza. Man, I don't think left with the pizza was was a healthy version, the cauliflower crust and all those. The only one that was left. Except for it was one brand called Big Mouth, I think is what it is. But it's like eight, nine dollars for a little pizza. I was like, Lord. So do y'all think it's going to taper off? Or it's going to like grow consistently? Like some of the other countries. Hey, Nicole, how you doing? Hey, These are my wings. <laughs> they got a little spice to them. But just enough. Just enough. <clears throat> I just finished watching. What's the name of it? It was a show where they go out and they meet their spouse, but they never they never see them. It was just on Netflix. And y'all know the name of that show. Like they're in these pods and that's the only way they talk to them. And they have like 32 days to figure out if they want to marry one of the guys or one of the girls and then get married. And they figure out whether they're going to marry him, like, prior to ever seeing him. And then once they see each other, you're basically planning your wedding. And that was on Netflix. I binge watched the whole thing. I was like, really? Is this how we're going to do it? So out of all the, it would have been like 10 couples. Six of them went through with it. Six couples. Two actually got married. And that was some craziness. The older lady and the younger guy, the one that was 24, and then I think the lady was like 34. She said no, but I'm glad she said no. She, she broke his heart. She really did. But she didn't want him, and she knew she didn't want him. I don't care what she say, how she tried to make it look. She didn't want him. She wanted that other guy. But then she's going to agree to marry him, get on, get on to the wedding and everything, and then say no. Broke his heart, but I was glad she said no. 
I was crazy. And then you have the crazy one. <laughs> I don't know nothing of you folks' name. Hey, Kibu Boss. How you doing? Chris Brooks. The girl said, hey, Chris. Tell my babies. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Those are my niece's daddy right there. So, which one was I on? Oh, I remember her name, but it's one. She kept going back and forth. One day she wanted to marry him. She all love it, love it, and everything. And the next minute, she's like, I don't know if I want to be with you. I'm going to take my ring off. I'm just, I'm not sure. I don't feel comfortable wearing a ring. Hey, Ton, how you doing? And so, When they finally got to the altar and got to the point of I do, he said he don't. I was happy about that one too. Because she needed to grow up some more. He was he was totally right in what he did. And she gonna call herself running on out and she ran down the street and all that. And then she ended up slipping in the mud. I said, mm-hmm, that's what you get. Now you like you got some mm on the back of your dress. <laughs> I did. That might have been wrong, but I did. Mm. Why do you have everyone? Hold on. Why do you have on? Why do I, let me tell you why I got on a hoodie. All last week, it was upper 60s, 70s. Today is 40-something degrees, 42 degrees. It's cold here. <laughs> And then going in and out. Hey, by your kitchen guy, how you doing today? I was telling them. I was kind of checking in to see if everybody was doing good. I had that little sinus cold. And... I knew I was getting one uh, back. I think it was like Wednesday because it was raining and I went outside and I had to cover my head and I knew I was getting one, but I don't like taking medicine. Hey, TT. I am cold. It's 42 degrees here. So I don't like taking medicine um, during the week because it has had an antihistamine and then it dried a gook up and it puts me to sleep. So I waited till this weekend to take some medicine and I took it and I slept all Friday evening, all Friday night and got up. But yep, this weather is something. If it ain't the Corona that's going to get you. Oh, I ain't mean to say that word. Because y'all know these folks crazy about the YouTube stuff. If it ain't that that's getting you, it'll be just sinus and stuff. I got me some wings. I got this. Here's my um sushi. Yes, I did eat some. Just don't worry about it. That's my sushi roll. Oh, it's trying to come at you. <laughs> I thought I was going to lose it. But I'm focusing on these wings right now. What kind of drink is that? It's the Flathead Lake Gourmet Soda, and this is the Huckleberry. I get it from Kroger. Absolutely love it. It is so good. It's so good. So, for the ones who just came in, how's everything going your way? Other than the crowds and the no food in the stores and all that, how are y'all feeling? I think Tennessee is up to 
32 now, 32 people. That was Friday. It was like 19 Wednesday, and then it jumped to like 32. So... Oh yeah, do try it. Try it. That's this is what this is my favorite drink now. It is. I was walking through the store, <laughs> looking at all the shelves and everything empty. I said, "What the mukbang is gonna do now?" <laughs> I mean, we still gonna be eating and everything. But I wonder if some of these people still gonna have these mountains of food and stuff. My teacher said, Oh, we have 10 now. One Jackson State student. It's close. Oh wow. It's time for people to just go home. Just go home and sit at home. Sometimes you have to learn how to be with yourself. But I was like, what the monk mongers gonna do now? We sitting out here with these piles of food and you know for the ones who do that. For the ones who do it. And all these different meals look like we're gonna start having some home cooked meals. And some individual portions like we should begin with. It got wasabi on it. Yeah, hear my phone. He was texting me. My coworker texted. She said. I don't think I'm feeling well. I, I was like, I think you need to stay at home tomorrow then. Don't be trying to come out. Stay home. We see you when you get better. Please do that, y'all. If y'all sick, stay at the house. That's all that it is. Frank just said they don't know how to cook, they in trouble. Are you right about that? Hopefully they can do some oodles and noodles. Tom said, need to know how to fry <laughs> bologna. Look, let me tell you something. Coming up real shortly, I'm going to have me some bologna sandwiches on here. Hey, Peaches, how you doing? Because I definitely bought some bologna and some hot dogs. It was about the only thing that was left. But I got some. <laughs> Which is funny, because all of the bread was gone. You know, as far as the loaf of bread. It was like when I walked around, because I, I like to walk around the store. Down, um, like by the meat that have little stands that have bread on it. So it was some wheat, some whole grain wheat bread on those. Then you have like all the high price bread, all the instant mash. I'm so glad all of y'all are doing good. I really, really wanted to see if y'all were doing how y'all were doing, basically. Because this thing getting serious. 
I'm starting to pick up right now because I'm really poor. Pick it up. Hey, Mama Dale, how you doing? <laughs> I just got me some wings, kind of checking in with everybody, saying how everybody doing. Got me some sushi. This ranch is actually a wing stop ranch because I stock up on it. I had mother and grandmother who showed me how to cook. That's the best cooking, Frank G, for real. Excuse me. The best cooking. I'm not about to eat no more of that. I'm full. I'm going to try to finish it. I can't do it. I'm full, but y'all see what I ate. And that's what it be. My mouth is on fire. Is that fire like Kyle? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, hey, Chuck Food Reviews and more. Let's see. What is it? 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 Hey, everyone. Hey, Frank G. Hey, John. Let's check uh, food reviews and more. He's speaking to Frank G. And John, uh, that's hot. It is hot. I got my mouth burning a little bit. It's the um, Louisiana Buffalo Wing Sauce. Hey, DK Sanjay. I mean, Ahmad, I think that's what they said. How you doing? <laughs> My teacher said, okay, I need to read the do's and don'ts of, of uh, YouTube. <laughs> I don't know mom myself. I'm going to be real honest with you. I really don't. They add something new every day, seem like. It's so funny. <laughs> Man, I'm full. I got full quick. That's all right. Please refrain from using numbers and please type the word. Thank you, John Tom. Y'all know when we go live, we can't do the um numbers because it was because it had numbers in it. So you have to spell your numbers out. So please spell your numbers out. Okay. And then um I'm looking at it going up. Thank you. Thank you. My mod squad. <laughs> Forever. I ain't never been trolled though in my life, but that's troll. <laughs> let me see. Hey, hey, I, I know somebody I can put on here. Mama Dale, if you still in the house, let me um right there. See if I can make her a mod for these trolls. They come in the right one. Come on. Egg white. Now, there we go. I'm going to go back down. Get that together. Okay. So, <laughs> you said eat more. Uh-uh. I can't eat more. I'm full. I ain't like what I ain't, ain't like. Some of the other ones that eat and eat and eat and keep eating. When I'm full, I'm full, and I'm done, and I'm done, and that's it, and that's it, and that's all it's going. That's all you wrote. But only two emojis. Hey, a little bit of everything. How you doing? How are you today? How's it going? Where you are? Where are you from anyway? Says I know eleven. I'm not sure about what that is. If need mod, I am here. That's Frank G. Got you. Because I try to read them all, but y'all, I, I, don't, I don't ever get them all to see what's being said. I really don't. A little bit of everything. How are you, host? I'm doing good. Here to say hi to you, my friend. How are you doing? How are you doing where you're from? And where are you from? Bye. Okay. Well, thank you for stopping in. I appreciate you. I really do. Okie dokie. Now, see, I got my mind squad in there. Mess with me. 
mess with me. <laughs> y'all, let's talk about you. If y'all have ever watched me, trolls and people that do stuff like that, they... <laughs> I, we have to take them out of here because YouTube will snatch my my uh, ability to go live. Put it in that sense, like that. However, they have never bothered me, not ever, not ever. I haven't had really a whole lot, you know, of dealings with them, but it's always comes across funny to me. It really come across funny. She said her phone is mute. So sorry, Fred can't hear you. Good food. Okay. Briefing on by Trump of coronavirus. Is that on um CNN? TT, you good? You are good. I'm pulling my phone out now. I was trying to find out how many cases we had here. Um, it hasn't gone up since the other day. It says, breaking news, the bold emergency action is meant to support the economy during the coronavirus. What is it? Fed cuts interest rates to zero. Okay, here it is. Trump speaks. I ain't, I ain't putting on that on my phone. It's going to be all right. <laughs> and that's what they're probably talking about, cutting interest rates to zero. And he was talking about doing it the other day with, like, loans and stuff like that. They were going to cut the interest rate to zero, which, you know, I guess if for those who pay on their interest and that's all they're paying because of they're in a tight situation anyway, that's good for them. Now they don't have to pay anything until everything is over with. Those who are paying currently on their loans and everything, it's good for them because it lessens their loan. And, you know, they're not taking that interest or adding interest, rather, to these ridiculous loans anyway. Those, that interest adds up. Hey, Familia de Estrada, how you doing? We just in here all kind of checking in with each other, seeing, make sure everybody's doing good. Hey, mama, that has Picky Dale. Did he go to the doctor? He was saying he wasn't feeling good, and maybe it was like some sinuses or something, but he was gonna go to the doctor and get it checked out. Did he ever go? And how's he doing? I know a doctor for me is probably like the last resort. I don't go to the doctor until I just know to know to know something wrong. It's probably the wrong thing to do now, but I have to be really certain something is wrong. I'm going to my, oh, I can't click out of that. Lord have mercy. Let this stay. That's all right. It was some videos I was getting ready to watch. <laughs> and I was moving them on out of there. I got to let that stay in my phone so I can go and watch them. So is, I saw um, <laughs> Yes, baby. <laughs> this is my daughter walking by. So um, what I was about to say, I got a question for y'all. Do y'all think doing that it's better to go ahead and switch over to something else. I'm not. Don't worry about it. I, I, this is what I love to do. This is what I'm going to do. Are there any of y'all who are thinking about switching to doing something else as a content creator? Are you thinking about maybe switching from food-based or mukbangs and doing something else? Somebody else said he is doing better. It was all his sinus and allergies. I understand that. I understand that. I feel like I need to take something now, but I really don't want to because I know it's going to put me on my back and I'm going to be asleep. He just had a really bad bout, so he had to stay in anyway because 
his immune system is low. Okay. All right. Well, I am glad that he is doing much better, but I know how those sinus can do you because they be tearing me up. Like I got a lot of sinus pressure on this side right now. I was supposed to go live Friday and I ended up not going live because my head was just pounding. And so I ended up taking some medicine and next thing I knew it was like 11. So I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie at all. <laughs> I really didn't. They are, and I, I rarely feel like sinus drainage. I know some people say when they have sinuses, they feel the sinus drainage down their throat. I rarely have that, but this time I do. So I was like, I, I gotta take something to uh, dry it up. And I ain't gonna fool with it this time. I put it off during the week because I gotta go to work. And I know that medicine takes forever to get out of my system. And I be sleep at work. But over the weekend, and I dope it up <laughs> and try to knock it on out. So nobody is thinking about switching over. I've been seeing a lot of people um on youtube switching and going to either doing the reaction videos or just vlogging or cooking videos i've seen a lot of uh, mug bungers switch over to that and i was wondering especially a lot of the ones that i started out with and um i was is that like the new fad or something they are minds do the same they are. Mine do the same. I hate them. <laughs> I was breaking this sentence up way too much. <laughs> yes. I sprayed down at work. I took my own personal Clorox bottle to work and sprayed down and cleaned. They may not have wanted to use Clorox, but it got Clorox that day. You know, our personal stuff, our like mini fridge and microwave and stuff that we use in our office. That stuff got wiped down. And I did it myself. It needed it, but hey, that office was smelling right. <laughs> Piggy Dad has a reaction channel too. Really? Put his link if you put his link in and I'll uh subscribe to it. If they cut the inches on Devin, Devin is my cousin, y'all. Student law, she's 21 now. <laughs> she's grown, 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 grown. And, but not too grown because she's still a baby. <laughs> if they cut the interest on Devin student loan, that'll make me real happy. I know that's the truth. Just on my own personal loans, it'll make me really happy. <laughs> that interest, it don't make no sense. Why student loan? You know what? Back when we were in college, and I guess now too, and in some different states, we're getting all these student loans and stuff like that. And then I come to Tennessee, and these these two children are going to school for free. Like you graduate high school, and even if you uh been out, you still can go back for free. Free your first two years are free. I was like. I need that when I was growing up. I took way more than two years, but maybe I don't focused if it was free. <laughs> but yeah, it was man. I'm telling you. Whoo, ooh, child. <laughs> but me and Dad started. I support all come visit. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I need free also. What just I need him just like to wipe it out. Just go ahead and get rid of the student loans. That would make me real happy. <laughs> to everybody that oh, don't worry about it. That would make me so happy right there. 
Made me so happy. I mean, my goodness. I don't know why it costs so much to go to school, especially if you're going to a public institu institution. Why? The kids here, they can get the promise or they can get the lottery. There's two, um, two ways they can have it paid. Maybe what call it scholarships or grants. If they're grants. Is the promise out of lottery if you're graduating from high school? If you've been out and you haven't attended anywhere and you don't have an associate, you can go back and you can get your associates for free here in Tennessee. I don't know if it's anywhere like that anywhere else, but I know here you can get it like that for free. So, yeah, that's how that works. And I'm like, I don't know why. And then we have we have students that come there and they don't that they're free anyway, but they're there and they come and they act nuts and they're loud and they like it's a party, like it's party time, and they're just doing whatever, and you flunking out. And I'm like, I try to see when I see some sometimes I'll be like, Yeah, don't take it, don't don't take advantage of this. Please take advantage of this, don't misuse it. Because when it comes time, you have to pay it out your pocket. Or you get them loans. You ain't going to think nothing of it while you're getting those loans. But when that bill starts coming for you to pay for it, that's another thing. So just take it, you know, take advantage of it and use it. Use it wisely. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see, y'all. Mama Dale said, I know I am happy. I finished paying Sally Mae back this year. And I, I remember when you talked about that. <laughs> I've been singing that song. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I know that's right. I rejected my last text because I thought I spelled interest wrong. But I, I see, I didn't. <laughs> I don't know what you was talking about anyway. Man, I wish I could say the same. I ain't had to pay on it none because I, you know, I, I am a single mom with three kids, so they ain't had me pay nothing on it yet. But my kids are growing up. As long as they're in college, I shouldn't have to pay on it. But then after that, they're gonna be wanting some money, and I'm hoping, you know, by that time I've been up in, I forget what it's called, but if you've been public service. For 10 years, you can get a loan forgiveness. And I'm hoping I'll be able to get that. I doubt it. I don't want to doubt it. I don't want that. Let me pull that back in. Pull that back in. Because <laughs> God can do anything. So if I can get that loan forgiveness and God, you know, not God, but, the, you know, them people, God get them people to forgive them loans and say, okay, you ain't got to pay that, then that'll be great. That would be great. <laughs> so, 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 so. But pick it that, I mean, Mama Dale, if you find his channel, drop it in for us. Let me check it out. Check it out. What is it called? I keep wanting to get on my phone and use that to uh, look up some stuff, but I don't need to. I know what I can do. It's always the way around it. I'm logging to my other account. If I go online, I got so many things open. YouTube. That's Keto Licious right there. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. Oh, it's so bright. My future's so bright. That's Keto Licious. Okay, I'm on my phone, so I don't know how to drop the link, but the channel is React Trends with Picky Dale. Okay. Let's see if I can find it. React Trends with Picky and Dale. Not fail. Dale. And not tact. React. <laughs> Y'all, apparently I can't spell. <laughs> Let's search it. 
So what I'm gonna end up doing is react trans to pick it there. Um, it's a channel. Mm. If anybody else, hey, Ton, if you're still here, if you're able to find it, can you drop it for me? I got his first one. Pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up, pick it up. Yep. Thank you. I had to go back and um subscribe to his channel. So y'all, this is Picadell's reaction channel that they're dropping down here. If y'all have do not have them, there it is right there. <laughs> I had to look up to see it. Uh, you know, I wasn't paying no attention. <laughs> That's why I need mods because. Some of this stuff I should be missing. I get caught. I was trying to find it on my phone and search it, but I couldn't find it. So I just had to go back to this last stream later and uh, subscribe to it. I subscribe to it from both channels. I don't know how many he has yet, but yeah. I have a second channel that I'm going to do, but I hadn't figured out exactly what I'm going to do with it just yet. I thought I was going to make it an ASMR channel, but I think I'm going to do ASMR and mukbangs on this channel. And just leave it here, leave the food stuff here. And then on my other channel, um, there's some other stuff. I might get on there and tell my life story. <laughs> so is there anything anybody wants to know? If y'all don't have each other, I believe everybody in here has each other. Any questions you want to know? Because a sister is like, and then ran out. Friend G, what's your other channel? Drop that in too as well. Normally, I ask if anybody uh, needed their playlist ran, but I have like nine channels for this week that I'm in the process of. Getting ran three at a time or two at a time, depending on, you know, how my Wi-Fi doing. And so I think I'm pretty much packed for this week. I see that. But next weekend, I'll get some more and run those. I, I want to say I have both of his. But I'm not sure. I just like and subscribe to Frank GTV. Woohoo! <laughs> you gotta like and subscribe, Frank GTV, for my TTN. And they just took it off TT because you can't say subscribe. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. They saw it though. He said thank you. <laughs> If you can't use the S word, you can't, uh, you have to spell out numbers and two emojis. Those are the three main things. I know I had all four fingers like Brumman from the fourth flow, but it's three main things. Yes. <laughs> so are those the only two that have, y'all? Hey, if you don't have Forever John Ton, please go and subscribe to Forever. And John and Ton. <laughs> Subscribe to them. We're getting them to a thousand. I'm pushing them, pushing them, pushing them to a thousand. So every video y'all come out with, y'all gonna hear their name forever. John and Ton. No, uh, no, no all caps, too. That's the fourth one. So forever John Ton right there. Subscribe to her and him. And if y'all can run that playlist, run it, run it, run it. Run it, run it, run it on regular speed. And I, I'm saying that, but I know everybody in here does it already. Bye, you kitchen guy. What time is it where you're at? 
And I'm asking because yesterday, I don't think that you went live, but I think you had talked about going live around noon. And I was like, we're saying noon, but it's here in the same time zone as I'm in. I know Mama Dan Piccadale, they're in Texas, so they are hour behind me. Uh, Ton is in the same time zone with me. So I keep up with them. 4.30, what time is it? Okay, all right. Wait, 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 wait. Where are you from? I guess I should know this, but where are you? If you don't mind me asking. Because you in the same time zone with us. I gotta start. I wish I had a big map behind me and I can start putting people on there. Frank GTV is on the East Coast. Or are you saying he's on the East Coast? East Coast, yeah, East Coast is our head. Like Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, Virginia, though up that way. You are, you're in the East Coast. Okay, okay, you're on the East Coast. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So you're an hour ahead of us. All right. I try to keep that in mind for when people uh, say what time they're going to go on because. Somebody will say like seven, and I'm like, okay, seven. But it may be seven my time, and they may not necessarily be in my time. You live in Texas? Really? And it's, you must be like on the border. And not like Central Texas. I don't know where that line cut off, but I know it's like Texas is normally an hour ahead of us. <laughs> so I go <gonna> get you. <laughs> I know I'm playing with my hoodie. I do this at work too when I have on a hoodie. North Texas. Okay. So you know, you may probably do 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 do. Do, 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 do. North Texas. I'm trying to envision a map in my head. No, it's the same time here. Really? For real? Y'all have the same time as us? I didn't know that. So when does it cut off and switch over? Because I know California is like two hours behind me. So I was thinking y'all was in a different time zone. I have to look at that. I have to look at that for real. And then last, was it last night? Yeah, last night. I was expecting to see uh, for my phone to go ding. And Tom was going to be live. Okay, y'all are central time zone as well. Okay, cool. Cool. That's an old school word, I know. But I don't know no new school word to fit that. I just don't. <laughs> I don't know if I would use it if I did. Okay, so by your kitchen, guys, North Texas. Mama there, y'all are in Houston? Area, I think. I'm not sure. I've been looking for um <laughs> she gave you rent. Oh, I've been looking 
looking out for cooking with Tracy. I mean, you know, still praying for her. Um, so if y'all know anything about her, do y'all do y'all have y'all heard anything from her other than the last video? And if y'all ever, you know, when, when you're praying and you can think about them, call her out in prayer. Yannette, she's the same way. Trying to be right outside of Houston. Okay. I didn't mean to put time on the end. That's quite fine. <laughs> yeah, my TT don't have a channel, okay? She don't have a channel. She's just she just supports me. She could have a hair channel because she does hair, but she doesn't have a channel. She she comes on and supports me. Her daughter had one. Um, I don't know if she's still active on it. She had a channel at one time. So yeah, she's a supporter. You haven't heard from her either. I hope she's doing good. I really do. I hope she's getting better. Uh, whatever the situation may be. And I know Yannette. I can't remember what her last name is. Yannette. Um, you too shy for that. <laughs> but I understand. I understand. I understand. But sometimes you just get on there, especially if you in your own zone doing what you love. Then... um. Yeah, it, you'll forget the camera's on. Hey, Ashley, how you doing? Yannette, Yannette had been sick for, uh, you know, she has muscular dystrophy, if I'm saying, if I, if I remember correctly. And um, at one point, she wasn't doing well, but she's doing better. I um, spoke with her this morning. So remember her in your prayers. Um, the Naturalish family, I don't know if they got baby yet. But I know, baby, it's time for the baby. <laughs> Keep them in your prayers, too. Yes, most definitely. I can do that most definitely. So let me see. It seemed like it was one other person. One other person. That I know was not really feeling the best. I can't remember right now. If I remember, I'll tell y'all later on. Great, 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 great. I'm glad to hear you're doing good. I am doing well here other than sinuses. I can't complain. We are doing well. Next week, I might be... <laughs> crying and booing going on because my baby got one more week left with me she got one more week and she leaving me i don't know what to do and then my other baby will be taking her test and then she'll be leaving and headed out the same place and it'll it be me and my son and my sister my niece but me and my son and my direct immediate family so 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 ask me some questions y'all ask me some questions because i don't know what to say i got these wings on this plate so I guess I asked y'all then. <laughs> do y'all think it's easier to do a channel with two people or one? I know with one person you can control what the topic is and what it's going, what your video is going to be about and all that with one person. But then with two people, hey, Cuisine Passion, how you doing? With two people, you kind of uh, have somebody to bounce things off of. Y'all kind of split the load. So I guess it's the um, pros and cons with both. 
unless you just really, really get along and y'all can delegate and get it done. Yes, we do. I'll be, I will be fine. I will be fine. It's hit me. It's almost like the emptiness syndrome, I guess. It's hit me um, more lately and probably this week that she is leaving. My babies have never really left the house. They kind of would maybe go on to camp a little bit or maybe once or twice. And once by themselves. That was it. Other times I went with them to camp, you know, because I could do that. Hey, Miss Sugar. <laughs> And so um, they spend the night over some friend's house, but I wasn't that parent that let you go spend the night over everybody's house. I wasn't, I wasn't that one. It's maybe two or three people that I allowed them to spend the night with. And so that's it. They've been with me, and we've been close like that for since they were little. Since they were little. And now she's getting ready to go off and be gone People, please wait while we try connecting. Ah, I hope y'all still see. Okay, there it is. I guess it didn't stop. The Wi-Fi been acting janky lately. So, yeah. Miss Sugar, how you doing? I've been asking about it. I slay spider bit for that. I know you're doing good. You told me so. Charles, hey Charles ASMR, how you doing? I told you I'll be missing stuff. She said, I understand because I was a mess when mine went to college. Then I had to stop knees. They're gonna keep me on my knees for sure. This Wi-Fi is acting up, y'all. Oh my god. So I hope it don't blink out, but it do. Sorry. <laughs> And it is, it's not more. I miss you speaking to forever, John Tun, Piccadale, Frank GTV. Hey, y'all. And I see everybody speak, 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 speak. Miss your video so much, though. Yes, I've been, um, when I found out my daughter was going to really leave and go like really quick, because at first we was thinking like towards the summer. But when she uh, decided to go, like, right off the bat, I kind of stopped doing the videos a little bit and started doing more lives. I do have things. I think I have some stuff sitting in front of me that I need to do in a mukbang. So I will be coming back with those videos. But I am going to continue to do my lives as well. Because uh, the lives give me my hours. I need them 4,000 hours so YouTube will start paying a sister to do a mukbang. That's what I'm needing in my life. Okay. So let's see. Where was I? Stop. Okay, there we go. What's that foot doing, Miss Shirley? She stepped on. Y'all watched the video. I know that had to be real. And she just moved. So how are you doing with that, Miss Sugar? <laughs> I have to say her name like that, y'all. Because that's how she say her name. It's Miss Sugar. Oh, I gotta get me a messy wig. I gotta go. I was waiting till my sister get here. Uh, I'm gonna try to get it this week. Slow motion. Like I'm on something. Y'all know um the last dra dragon where he's he's doing his thing. That's what that looked like. She moved back with her mom. Okay, okay. It's stopping a lot, so I'll talk to you later, honey. Much love to you all. Thank you, TT. That case always it is, and I'm probably gonna go ahead and get off of it. Keep on, you know. I don't know why these internets are messing up like they're doing. I, it's, I go ahead and get off. But it's messing up. Oh, your connection is unstable. Please wait while we try reconnecting. You're buffering. 
Thank you, Fama John Tun. Till then, may God cat may God gladly. Y'all know my outro. May God. It won't even click. Oh. Yeah, and it.